no, no, no. Yeah. Faster than me. He's faster than he is in the other car too. It's the Mario line. Oh my god. Well sideways. Oh, I didn't see that.
Was it what you expected? Yeah. Carl, you need to learn to talk up your game because it wasn't what he expected. <laughs> it wasn't what he expected. So Dave, how was your eight tenths drive? Oh, we're gonna have to look at the brakes. And that's the word about this. He really did. We were very disappointed. That was amazing. Yeah. Ah. All before breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> Luckily, huh? No kidding. Well, breakfast is very expensive and you don't want to lose it. <laughs> oh, man. That was awesome. That was great. I can see it now. I know why you guys do it. Oh, oh. We're reading up that other bit straight away. Unbelievable. <laughs> There was about three cars we passed at one point in time. I, I, we came up on so fast. No, there was no more. No, 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 no. <laughs> you realize on this run that he had to know that there was somewhere to go because he wasn't intending to need to slow down quickly, like normal. So he did everything very cautiously for you. Well, relatively speaking, relative, that's different. Sure. That's different than anything you've ever oh had. God, that was insane. Oh, they oh. say once you've risked your life in a car with someone else behind the wheel. It changes everything. It does. Of a lifetime. Honestly. That was great. Rocky, I've never seen you shake. <laughs> That's awesome. It really is. Fantastic. Yeah, everyone should try that. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. You, you, so you cross that one off. I will. That's, that's checked off for sure. <laughs> that's amazing. Oh my god. You can imagine. No. Especially going into the turn. You can't imagine. That's what I was right. blown away yeah, by. Yeah, because you go, wait, you're going to break, you're going to break, you're going to break, you're going to break, you're not no, breaking. No, 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 no. Now you are. Wait a minute. We're going to die. Yeah, that's, yeah. to me, that's that's the most impactful. Yeah. Is it, and then the second is going through the turn, you think your car's just going to fly out of the track. Right. Because it's just all of this collateral genius. Yeah. Uh, so how do you like when the pace car went off, then he went to oh. the bridge, I go, then okay, on. he's on it now. That was and on. Then, Drifting wide on this last turn before the hairpin at the uh -huh. end. Just and then right passing. The we passed somebody over there. Oh, yeah. Oh, and she got oh. Right there. It was right yeah. there. Yeah. And you can feel, feel the car lift and then just slide. And then he just gains it just whips around. Yeah, that was insane. That was so <laughs> insane. That was awesome. That was, yeah, <laughs> simple easy. The feeling sure. you have right now will last a few. Oh, I think so. <laughs> oh, it's lasted for him for years. Well, yeah. Well, it's, well, it's never going away on me. No, no, no. Man. Never forget. That's awesome. Yeah. So I, I got to experience a little what you did last week. Oh, my God. That's great. That is. Now what do you do? Yeah. So it's a bit, it's a bit intimidating. People drive it. It's my favorite track. It's our home track. We drive. We love. We've got track records there and everything. Uh -huh. We've been driving this for so long. But for most people, it's walls, 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 right? Really? But, yeah. And you're carrying speed through those corners differently than here. Here it's brake, turn, brake, turn, brake, turn. At Sonoma, you've got sequences of turns where you're carrying speed where if you lift, you're going off. So you have to stay on it. And you commit yourself to those high speed corners, the S's. That if you're not on the gas just right, the car will get loose and come around. And you feel it in the seat of your pants and the driver's in complete control. And that, my friend, there's nothing like, you don't get that experience here. You just don't, it's absent. It's absent. It's so much more technical of a course. This is not a technical course. So after all this, yeah. I'm telling you is there is more. <laughs>
Thank you. Yeah, we wasn't experienced. That that was a, that was the most insane part. I mean, the acceleration, the acceleration, the turns. Yeah. 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 Two times, I right? Here. And, I did, and coming I around a couple of those corners, and you took, but well, when you took that guy coming down before we got to the corner there, or in the corner, that was awesome. And you took that inside turn, you went wide, I thought, oh my We're god, dead. this is it. What was I doing here about this turn? That's what died. He's driving fast. Yeah. Look here. You're in a safe environment and learn the skills. Right? Learn the skills. Really learn it. Not none of this stuff where you got, oh my God, I got to go for a few seconds and I'll pass in a few seconds or dashing between people to put, you know, drinking their coffee or putting the makeup on and totally distracted. Just to actually happen. But learn the skills and do it. And if you're good at it, who knows? A good race, you know, by introducing you to NASA, they get the money, but we will help you if you want to go beyond what they can offer you. We'll take over and teach you how to race. If you don't want to go abuse your car, we've got to have so, a race for anything. You know, it's a lot of people have the passion, you know, like I do, and a lot of people out there don't know that there's a way to channel that passion in a safe and safe environment like yeah. this. It's just, it's available. And I try, I try to get the word out any way I can. I didn't know. I used to be a stupid kid that would drive fast on the street. Right. You know, 150 on the highway. And, you know, stupid stuff. I didn't know 150 you know, you have. But you do it all here. Right. And you know what? When I got on the track, I, I stopped speeding. I can, I can actually imagine that. All you need no to do, to. Well, well, all you need to do is to loop the car once at 50 miles an hour going around a turn on the track and say, how did that happen? You know, oh, jeez, it happened that fast. I don't even know what happened. This was in my early days. If it happened that fast out here, there's no reason why on the streets it can't happen. You see stuff happen on the track and how fast an incident can happen if somebody does something unexpected. You just have to get a lot of people are driving distracted out there, right? Oh, hell yeah. So I, I just, I try to get the word out, try to get the word out. It's my way of giving back. You know, I feel very fortunate to, yeah. to, to achieve what I've achieved. And, and I, want, I want to share with you. Yes, look, come on out here. Yeah, yes, learn about it. We will show you how to do this. Maybe you get good enough where you go racing, and if you get really good, maybe you can sponsor to help you go racing. Very cool. Well, yeah, uh, I I can totally understand it, and uh, it's interesting because I thought when getting in the car, you know, what's the rest of my day going to look like when I get in my car? You know, sometimes you get that adrenaline, and it's just after that you just want to go. Uh, well, interestingly enough. As I got out of the car, after racing around the track, there's honestly there's no reason when I when I cruise out of here, there's no reason to go above speed limit. It's the weirdest thing. I just it is really strange because I was thinking of just the opposite. I'm going to be so adrenalized. I've got to watch out how I drive when I leave here. Uh, at least at this moment. <laughs> no, at least at this moment. At least at this exactly. No, I don't. I don't think there's any reason. Interesting. It, this is just. A, yeah, it's an experience you can't put into words. It's a behind-the-scenes experience. That's it. Like that. Like the tour you gave us. That's it. There you go. We got a brand uh, new motor. Yeah. We just dynoed it yesterday. Uh -huh. And we're we're right on the border between TT1 and TTU. I, I prefer the TT1, I think we'll be more competitive, Yeah. but you know, in the end, it's a brand new motor, we've got work that we got to do with the tuning of the motor, yeah, we can slap a bunch of weight in, because we're right on the border, it's a horsepower to weight ratio deal, but we said, now let's just, let's, let's take that pressure off us, let's just go get experience with this motor in the car, and let's just go run TT1.